Okay, I'm on live again today. Uh, where's Lance at? Lance, let me know when you come on, you pig. You pig! A ver cuando viene. Anyway, so actually today, since I haven't put a video, probably about in, in about a week or so, because I've been really, really busy. Oh, shout out to PJ real quick too. He came by the restaurant uh, about a week ago and he saw the pelona and he goes, hey, pelona, que que what? Anyway, so shout out to PJ. But today's a special video. I know, so today's a special video for somebody that sent me a message. Ay, no es cierto, que paso? Ay, disculpa. Anyways, oh, so today, shout out, oh, shout out to my cousin Jessica. Andas bien cuernuda con los cuernos. Cuernos, cabrona, cuernos, okay? God, I, oh, oh, as you can tell, I'm doing something different to my hair. I'm not doing that other thing in the front. I'm doing the comb over, but I don't like it because you see this shit, so I gotta let it, I gotta train it, I guess, or some fucking shit like that. Anyways, so today's video is a special video series for somebody that's following me and their mother, I guess, is going through stage three cancer. So I wanna give a shout out to Anna for being a good fighter on trying to cope with this uh, issue of, of cancer. Uh, the guy sent me a message privately all the way from Flint, Michigan. And as we all know, Flint, Michigan is one of the battleground states. But you know how that is. Uh, I hope you're a Democrat. Anyways, so I want to give a shout out to Thomas Edward is his name. Thomas Edward and his mom, Anna. Uh, he had sent me a message and I want to share this with everybody. He sent me a private message saying that... Um, He's taking care of his mom, and he's going through a hard time right now with his with because take, he's taking care taking care of her. She's going through stage three cancer, and he or she has not had the energy to laugh or, or to feel happy. I, I guess, and I guess it was she came across my videos with him. I guess she was watching them or he shared them with her. She almost choked on her chicken while she was eating it because she was laughing so hard. So. When people tell me that they don't like the way I talk or the things that I say, a la verga, me vale madre. And I'll tell you why. Because if I can make somebody feel a lot better that's going through cancer or that's going through a tough time in their life and I bring joy to them and happiness and I can make them laugh. Because if I can make somebody laugh just for five or 10 minutes, that can make and change somebody's day for the whole day. Look, there's already people leaving. A la verga, cuernos cabrones, cuernos. Anyways, so back to my story. So I enjoy when people send me messages telling me that they like that I make their day or that I make them laugh or that they, uh, you know, that they were feeling down and that they watched my video and I really made their day. They like the way I talk and they give me uh, input. Don't worry about what people say. People are always going to hate. That includes you, Sally Gayton. Yeah, vieja, pinche vieja jota mal cogida. That's why I'm talking to you too, también. Anyways, that's, that's a joke, don't take it serious. Anyways, so it brings me excitement and joy when somebody sends me a private message and tells me they enjoy watching my videos and especially when their mother is going through a tough time to stage three cancer. I don't know what that's like because I've never had to deal with that except for when my grandmother had it. I think she had stage three or stage four. I don't remember correctly, but I think she had the final one. And my grandmother did pass away, so those things are tough you know, when somebody to, to go through. But then you get all these Christians and all these people that talk shit. And yeah, you know who I'm talking about, especially my aunt and my uncle. Yeah, I said it. I said it, cuernos, cabrones, cuernos. Uh, all about God this and God that. But oh, but there they go, casting the fucking first stone. The lady that came in right now? How, what'd she say? She goes, I like the way he talks. I like the way he talks, all positive and everything. Oh, the customer said that right yeah. now? He just came in? Oh, goes, how lovely. Really? The customer. Really? Really? See, and that's what I like is when people and and this is what I found out. I'm not gonna be golden for everybody. Ask my cousin Jessica about it. She'll tell you how people hate on me. Um, there's always gonna be somebody that's are in their old or young that says I don't talk right. That I don't say. You know what? Don't worry about what I do. Worry about what you do. Pinche gente mal cogida. A la verga. No, I'm, I'm sick and tired of it. And so this special video, anyway, so the whole purpose of this special video is a shout out to Thomas Edward and his mom, Anna, who's going through a very tough time. And I'm gonna tag you in the, in the video so you know that this is for you. 
And oh, so the, oh, okay, so that was the whole purpose of, of this video was for you. So the topic now that I'm gonna talk about that's gonna make your day, Anna, gonna make you laugh. Just don't choke on another piece of chicken though. Uh, is crazy ex-husbands. And yeah, I said it. I'm gonna use my sister as an example, okay? I didn't say no names, okay? So I don't like it when, well, you know, it's not that I don't like it, I don't give a shit, that's you, I don't care, a la verga, but uh, take your kids to go get haircuts and don't be going telling all the riverbank talking shit about your ex-wife, and this goes for everybody in general. Anybody's got an ex-husband or an ex-wife. Don't go around talking shit to everybody around town saying that they're on welfare when they never were on fucking welfare. Don't go around talking shit saying you supported them because you didn't support shit, okay? Let's get that fucking shit clear. Okay, you didn't support fucking jack shit. Oh, just real quick, there goes my ADHD. Shout out to Marcellus from Texas. I actually had a video with him over the weekend. It was on Sunday. Uh, we talked for about a half hour. Texas is doing good, doing except for the lockdown going on. And yeah, I got my mask for esa gente pendeja que no se ponen sus máscaras a la verga. Okay, anyways, so back to my story. I, I gotta make little note cards because I go off topic and then I forget what the fuck I talked about. Okay, so anyway, yeah, stop going around saying that they're on fucking welfare. Okay, yeah, and I can bet you right now, oh, oh, he's talking about you. Oh, yeah, can you believe he's talking about you? Toma, cabrón, toma. You don't like what I gotta say? Fuck it, get off here, I don't care, okay? Eat shit, drop dead and die, okay? Anyway, uh, so, oh, shout out to my cousin Tony. Uh, I hope everything works out for you. I hope everything went well for you over the week. Hey, cabrón! Vete la verga! Pinche puñetero, puñetón, cabrón. Tú hablando con ese pinche culo prieto, cabrón. Que se pasó ahorita. Anyway, so, are you trying to be a crazy ex-husband? Okay, or, okay, but I, I don't say no names or crazy ex-girlfriend, okay? But everybody knows what I'm talking about and who I'm talking about, okay? But there's always gonna be some asshole that's gonna hate, oh, so and so's talking shit, yeah, let me do it again. So and so's talking shit about you. A la verga, okay? So, and and go get your kids haircut and quit using the excuse to be like this, fucking tight, your money, cuadro. Hey, vente para acá. Déjame contarte una historia. Vente para acá, mandar un saludo a la gente. Vente para acá, no sea latina. Ay, no es cierto. Okay, anyways, so oh, hold on. Va a poner tu máscara porque tiene miedo que la gente le van a mirar. Ay, tiene miedo que me contagie del no, coronavirus. Máscara. ¿Qué es eso? ¿Qué qué what? <laughs> Pinche perro. Está cuernudo, está Así cuernudo, está okay. cuernudo. Mira, estamos a, hablando de los ex esposos que le están uh, diciendo cosas malas a las ex esposas. Son los esposos que no sirven para ni vergas. No okay. sirven para que pura cagada. ¿Qué eso, es eso? eso mero. Y también, uh, corta tus pelos de los sí, niños. Sirve para tres cosas, para chingar su madre, para chingar su madre, para chingar su madre. Eso, eso mero, eso mero. So stop being so fucking tight with you. Oh, shout out to Carlos Margado, who just got in. Uh, I, just real quick, I'm gonna go off the topic here real quick. He actually put the, he backed the ambulance in reverse and put it in the ditch. I remember that, but I wasn't working with him. Thank you, Jesus. Okay, anyways. Um, so quit talking shit, okay, that's one. And quit being such a fucking crazy ass. Sending stupid ass messages about how you had this because of you. Dude, you didn't pay nothing. Obviously, okay, let's go there. When you get a divorce with somebody, obviously because you weren't doing it right, okay? What do I always say? If what you don't do for your man, or what you don't do for your woman, somebody else will. If they want you to swallow, you swallow. If they want you to piss on them, you piss on them. And if they want you to shit on them, you shit on them, okay? Because remember, what you don't do for your dude or your girl, some other fucking bitch or some other fool will do it for you. Remember that, okay? And I'll give you another good example. I'm not gonna say no names, okay? Oh, Kiki, that stuff is nasty stuff. That's not stuff of God. Well, what is stuff of God? Did the Bible, hey, did the Bible give you a manual on how to have sex? Did the Bible tell you, oh, you couldn't do oral, you couldn't swallow, uh, you couldn't do this, you couldn't do that? No, I don't ever remember reading anywhere that said you, that there was guidelines, that there was rules on what you could and could not do. You do what you want to do that sexually satisfies you and your dude or your girl. Because if you don't, te van a dejarte cuernudo o cuernuda. Cuernos, cabrones, cuernos. Remember that I said that, okay? Yeah, I said it. Uh, 
Also too, real quick, I also want to give a shout out to my cousin Joseph Lopez, or also known as Bubba. Uh, he passed away and, uh, uh, and it's sad to hear that. So let's take a moment of silence real, real quick, okay? Five seconds. Okay, so, you know, uh, shout out to my cousin Joseph. You know, it's sad that, you know, you're here one minute and you're gone the next. It's sad that, you know, sometimes things happen like that. But for whatever reason why things happen, we don't know, only God knows, and I do believe in God. You know, and, 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 uh, and I do want to, ah, mira, mi tío está aquí, Jose. Jose Reyes, anda bien cuernudo. Le ponen los pinches cuernos. Anyways. Uh, so, you know, so I want to give a shout out to my cousin, Joseph, who was taken to so soon. Uh, the last time I saw him, boy, it's been a while since I saw him. He actually came here to the restaurant and stuff like that. And I hooked him up with a burrito. I gave him a burrito and stuff like that. And uh, and it's always good to give a helping hand. Okay, I will say that. Okay. So anyway, so shout out to him. He'll be missed. Okay. Uh, anyway, so back to my story real quick now. So I don't go off sidetrack here. Let's see. Uh, where the hell was I at now? God, I'm always all over the place. Ay, no cierto, la verga. Okay, oh, and uh, uh, just real quick, uh, one time Jose, my dad, and Raymond were together, and I guess Jose threw the fishing rod and playing with it, and you know how they have that little weight with, with the melted metal? Well, I guess he threw it, and it, he, it didn't go all the way, and it swung back, and it hit the windows of the truck he had, and he goes, call Stella, call Stella, call Stella. So they called Stella, right? You know what they said? You know what she said, Brianna? When she answered the phone, she goes, what did, what did stupid do? I go, oh my God. Oh, and then also shout out to my cousin Boo-Boo's. I uh, hope that's all working out for you. The reason why I say that, um, I told her that I wanted to lose weight. I told her, go, my pants are not fitting. And I told her, man, I'm gonna have to call Phil and Annie because I gotta do something. I said, I don't know what you're smoking or what you're sniffing, but I need what you need because you're losing weight and you're losing it quick. So I need to know what the recipe is. So Annie or Phil, call me. I need to get some. If I can get a dime bag, okay? And that's just a joke. So take it serious, I'm not a drug addict. Okay, it was just a fucking joke. No, you gotta speak, cause you gotta, you, you know how, never mind, you know how the Christians are. Okay, anyways, so back to the ex-husband. Si tu estabas culiando tu esposa o tu esposo bien, no te ponen los pinches cuernos, okay? Remember that, okay? Uh, and just, you know, get over it. Quit talking about your ex-wife. Get over it, you know what I mean? It's already been what? 11, 12 years, 13 years? Get over it, okay? Go find yourself a woman. Go get fucking laid. Have somebody suck on it or sit on it or do something. But dude, get a life, okay? So that's what I'm talking about. So that's for the crazy ex-husband and you know who you are, okay? Uh, also, shout out to Shauna Shavalski. Uh, you think your shit don't stink? I talked to you on the phone. Uh, but anyways, you're cool though. I still love you. Okay. Uh, Carlos, stay in touch. Come to the taqueria. No seas cabrón y cuernudo. Tony, you're cool. Uh, anyway, well, I'll tell you in private. Okay. And then let me see. A ver si hay gente que tiene comments. Hold on. Okay. Because I haven't read them yet. Ay, no cierto. Okay. Give me one second. Hold on. Talk about what Chris did. Oh, okay. Nah, I don't want to talk about that shit. You know, the less people know, the better, okay? Oh, and when you move, don't fucking tell people where you move. Don't tell people where you live. Because the minute you tell people where you live, they're going to go to your house and they're going to break your shit. Good example, my cousin Joey Cruz. Yeah, I said it, Joey Cruz. And by the way, when you see your dad, ask him how that's working out for him, okay? Uh, let me see. Uh, Belinda, shout out to Belinda. Hi, Belinda. Uh, let's see, who else is going to send me messages here? Shout out to Jose, I already did. Anda bien cuernudo. Uh, Taylor Swift, haters gonna hate. Shake it off. And hey, you know what? Let's play that song, Shake She. Let's do that song, Shake It Off. I want to make my own words, do a fucking music video. Uh, hey, do you see me? Belinda, I do see you. I'm just having been. I turned off the messages. Her, que es eso? Que has de pelonas here for PJ. Uh, damn, you have a list. I, oh yeah, hell yeah, I got a list. Because my ADHD starts kicking in and then I don't remember what the hell I'm talking about. I gotta end this video pretty soon. I remember sharing is caring. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so just real quick, let's go to that. Chill, jefe, you're gonna get high blood pressure. Shit, ya me lo dieron a la verga. Always needing a disclaimer. Heck yeah, my cousin Jessica. 
yes please talk about what what he did no i'm not gonna do it. everyone knows everybody knows okay anyways so what the hell was i gonna talk about oh yeah it's always good to have an open relationship and this is what could have happened why in the hell would you have a monogamous relationship because remember the bible never gives guidelines on what you can't and cannot do it just says what did it say something about adultery i don't know what else but they didn't say you couldn't share they didn't say you couldn't do polygamy shit the mormons do it so might as well everybody else do it anyways um so if i was you just share Com how do i say compartir con tu vato con tu esposa con tu mujer lo que sea fanny you know what i'm talking about okay he, 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 uh, uh, so always share at least that that's what i say okay and i know there's going to be christians on here oh look at the way he talks you know what don't worry about the way i talk pinche gente mal cogida ya sabes quien eres pinche jota okay anyways so i just wanted to mention that real quick so once again before i close because i'm going to end the video here pretty soon shout out to thomas edward and his mom anna who's going through a tough time right now with stage three cancer I'm really happy and glad that you enjoy watching my videos and they make your day through this difficult process of your life at the moment, okay? Hopefully you get better. Only God will know what's ahead for you, what's in the road for you, and whatever it is, it's God's will. But don't worry about it. Everything happens for a reason. So if you ever want to go live with, with me, Anna, let me know, okay? Call me. I'll crack you some jokes. I'll tell you the truth, okay? Uh, just give me a call. Have your son Thomas Edwards from Flint, Michigan to send me messages and shout out to the state of Flint, Michigan, the battleground state. Hopefully the Democrats take it over this year. Is it this year? I forgot. I don't even remember. Okay. Because I cannot believe we got stupid people in the White House. And yes, I said it. I have my own opinion. Okay. We got stupid people in the White House. Okay. That's just my story. But then again, like I always said, you're never going to be golden for anybody. So they can all eat shit, drop dead and die. Okay. The ones that don't like what I gotta say. Let me make sure I clarify that, okay? Anyways, uh, so I'm I'm gonna go. Uh, if you got a crazy ex-husband, put a restraining order on his fucking ass. Uh, obviously he wasn't eating it right or licking it right. So whatever, but that's another story for another day. I don't give a shit, okay? Um, and you know, treat your kids well. Buy them, and then I'm not saying go buy them expensive ass, flashy ass shit, but don't be gullible. Don't be cheap, okay? Cut their hairs. Don't go around them walking around looking like bums. Just because you want to save money in the winter time. Because you want them to grow. What was it he wanted them to grow? A fur coat? Or some shit? What What was it a coat again? Hold on. Let me see what the hell was it. Again. Yeah. Because you want them to grow a fur coat? What kind of shit is that? Anyways, I don't, I don't get it. Um, You only got kids one time. Enjoy it. The Ten Commandments. Yes, the Ten Commandments didn't say... You know what? The Ten Commandments didn't say you couldn't do it doggy. The Ten Commandments said you couldn't do it missionary. The Ten Commandments said you couldn't do it orally. It didn't mention it. So have fun and do it. Right, PJ? Be open with your relationship. Bring other couples in. Do couples play. Be safe, though. You know, be safe. Amigo, what's the name of the restaurant? Taqueria El Mexicano in Modesto, California, okay? Taqueria El Mexicano in Modesto, California. Oh! By the way, I told everybody that I was going to give something away. It's called, what's that damn Google thing, the Google map? The little tiny little thing. Uh, I'm going to be giving it away. I'm going to be popping up some questions. And if you get it right, and even if you're from out of state, I will mail it to you. Okay? If you're local, you can come by and pick it up if you were to win. Okay? I'm going to write the actual answers, what they are. And whoever gets them all correct wins the, the nest egg. Brianna, what's that shit that you talk about that says, hey, Google? That little machine, I forgot what the hell they call it. Anyway, I got one at the house and it always fucking goes off. Every time I say, hey Google, hey Google, hey Google, the thing always goes off, never stops. Anyways, I'm gonna go, I'll probably do another video come to the customer, a la verga. Ay, ya, ya, you know, cierto. So anyways, so, uh, ay. anyways, okay, so shout out to everybody. Oh, shout out to all my fucking haters. Uh, que coman verga y que se chinga su madre la gente me vale verga uh, so that's it about that if you don't like what I gotta say oh well tough shit drop dead eat shit and die okay anyways you guys have a good day hold on I gotta go from Elk Grove do I get a discount Matthew?
for Ramos, Ramon Campos, I'll give you a discount, 10%. You come down here, you let me know you're coming, I'll let one of these cuernudas know right here. Brianna, say hi. Hi, everyone. Okay, I'll let Brianna know, and she will, uh, she will uh, give you a discount. But if you catch me in a good mood, which usually I am, unless tan chingando aquí o a la verga, you know how people are. I'm just my hook up with a free burrito. With the agreement that you tell the people you came all the way from Elk Grove just to see me and to visit the restaurant. I'll hook you up with a free burrito or a discount, whichever you prefer, okay? So that's for Raymond Campos, right? Is that R-A-M-O-N? Shit, I'm a bad spell. Shit, I got on the degree and I can't even read. Shit, goes to tell you to the U.S. Uh, educational system. Anyways, I gotta go. You guys have a good day. Where's your camera guy? Camera guy in here. Anyways, uh, today's the day off. Anyways, I gotta go. Hopefully my hair trains more over and it gets a little thicker and fuller so I can do my full comb over. So I got tired of doing the same shit. And then also crazy ex-husbands go to hell. You don't know what you're talking about. Just go get laid. And we'll go from there. And yeah, you got a deal. Raymond Campos. And then again, like I said, shout out to Anna. Anyways, talk to you guys later. Gotta go. Oh, I'm gonna go to the dollar store and I'm gonna teach you how to cook a meal. We're gonna make a welfare meal. Okay, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna make a welfare meal. Tengo. Necesitas pastillas para la riata para que se te para, cabrón. Cuernudo. Ay, a la verga ya. Anyways, okay. I gotta go. Oh, oh, y Marta, y Yolanda, y Verónica, andan bien cuernudas. ¿Tú crees que tu esposo no te ponen los cuernos? Son par de... Pen How do you say three? A par is a pair. Whatever. Son par de cuernudas. ¿Tú no crees que tu hombre no te está poniendo los cuernos? Estás pendeja. Anyways, I gotta go. Que pasa buenas noches. Maybe I might make another video tonight. A la verga. Oh, uh, un saludo. A toda la gente pendeja que habla mal de mí, que se van a ir chingar a su madre por la calle más recta y a la verga, me vale verga. Y que no gusta la manera como hablo, que coman pura verga. Adiós.